Hello, Darlene here of True Harmony Media, and I've recently been asked how to export an audio file as an MP3 using Audacity, and it's really a simple step. So what you will have in your Audacity is your audio file, and right now I have an audio file uh, in place, and it's a .wav file, and I want to export it as an MP3. So all I need to do is go to File, and then select Export as MP3. Save it, save it, name my file to whatever name I want it to be, and click Save. And now, a box pops up that says Edit the ID3 tags for the MP3 file. And it's very important not to skip this step and just hit OK, leaving these fields blank. What you'll want to do is include the title of your, your audio file, your artist name, the album, track number, year, genre, and something in comments. Now when it comes to genre, if you're exporting uh, something that's not a music file, maybe a podcast, I would usually choose other. And then in comments, what I utilize the comments section for is maybe to put something like for more information or details or to subscribe to the podcast visit, and I'll put my web address. You can do that, or you can also put uh, some form of contact like your email address or something like that. Okay, so there, I've entered all of my information that I want to appear for the ID3 tags for my MP3 file. And now I'm going to go ahead and click OK. And it's going to export my entire audio as an MP3 file. And while this is doing this, I, I just want to say that you won't be able to export any files as MP3 using Audacity until you install the LAME MP3 encoder. And you can look on my YouTube page and you will find a video that instructs you how to install that LAME MP3 encoder. So now the MP3 file has been exported and I just want to go ahead and show you the file and why it is important to enter the ID3 tags. The title is there, the test audio file. The contributing artists was the artist name that I entered in the ID3 tag. And the album test audio hits, that's another thing that I entered. If I were to right click on this, choose properties, and then details, you will see there's the title in the comments so people would know to visit my website. They can see that there. Uh, album, track number, the genre, the length, which is automatic, that just uh, does happens on export, and that's it. If you go ahead and play this up here, you'll see that some of the labels will be shown. So it shows the album name, the, uh, the track title, and the artist. So this way, using the ID3 tags, kind of puts your stamp on your audio file. So that is how you take an audio file in Audacity and export it as MP3. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Thank you for watching.